I think this is the first time a cut tool has been moved to the edit page. It's normally the other way around. Anyways, the trim edit tool is a way to precisely adjust your clips uh, frame by frame within the viewer. So let me quickly show you how it works. So let's add these clips onto the timeline. So now we have our different cut points here. All we have to do is just double click on one of those cut points. And now we have the new trim edit tool here. Let me open this up so you can see this. And so how this works is you can see a zero, one, two, three, four. Uh, that allows us to move this first clip over here, either backwards in time or forwards in time. And then the same way here, uh, we can have it go uh, into this edit or go backwards. So if I click and drag, we can see that we are adjusting that clip. And the same way if I drag this over or drag it in, we will have that. If we want it to uh, affect both sides of the cut, we could click on this middle point and then we would easily be able to uh, go back and forth just like that. So that is pretty much the trim edit tool. If you wanted to get out of this, you could come up here and hit the little X. Obviously you typically have it like this. So just again, double clicking, uh, you can make your edit, then coming up here, clicking the X will get out of the trim edit tool. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. There's not much more to it than that. It was, like I said, previously on the cut page, allowing you to make precise edits, but now has been moved over to the edit page. If you wanna know more about the different tools and features that were added into DaVinci Resolve 19, take a look at the YouTube channel. I go over each new feature that was added in DaVinci Resolve 19. If you wanna join in on the discussion about DaVinci Resolve 19 and all of its new updates, join me over on Post Pro List where we are discussing all of the new tools and features within DaVinci Resolve 19. And with that being said, my name is Justin Robinson. Thanks so much for watching this one and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.